everyone, and welcome back to Dog Sled Saga, where we are celebrating the arrival of a brand new puppy. Everpine and Max have just had a little girl. So this is Everpine's second puppy of the season, and it takes after her once again. So we have a beautiful German Shepherd, and we're really hoping that this German Shepherd's favorite thing will be petting, because that's what we're specifically trying to breed for in our kennels. But we're going to have to see. So new puppy is back. Everpine and Max are back, which means we have very expensive league dues coming on in too. And we are going to have to go ahead and uh, name this little one. So her sister is Winterwind. Her mother is Everpine. Her father is Max. So I'm thinking maybe we should go ahead. Um, let's name her. We have Everpine and Winterwind. I kind of like that theme that we've been going for. Uh, let's go with Snowstar. I kind of love that. We're going to go ahead and go with Snowstar and we're going to see what kind of puppy little Snowstar will be come over the next few weeks. We will have the same opportunity to train her as we had with the opportunity to train Winterwind. But we are kind of in trouble because now our league dues are $32,000. I don't think we need to have that much when we're not racing all of these dogs all of the time. So I'm thinking what I probably should do is Yuki has been thinking about retiring for a long time now. And now that Max is back, that may be what we do. Everpine is listed as a wheel dog, but her natural ability is actually as a lead dog. Ooh, Mary is our mascot, so we can't get rid of her. I kind of feel like Winter Wind, she's so cool. I would love to take her out on at least one race, but we're in no position to do that. All right, we'll make the hard decisions when the time comes to actually have to pay the dues and we might have to say goodbye to a pup or two um, who aren't part of a like stellar team so that we can try to bring the price down a little bit. And Yoshi, I, I wanna keep Yoshi for the whole season at the very least, but I do already have a great lead dog with Domino um, and he is not getting that fatigued. So we're gonna have to think carefully about this. But all right, let's go ahead. And plus we do still have some other dog varieties like the Black Labs and the Schnauzers. I have been, oh, and their favorite things are petting. <gasps> if we actually go ahead and give up one of our current dogs, we can adopt one of the dogs who we know what their favorite thing is already. Mm. And strong or obedient, strong, I think, helps out with being in the middle or being at the front. Steady is the best for being in the middle though. So I think we'll go ahead and we'll hold off. Uh, well, I don't know, but favorite thing, petting? That's kind of a big deal. And I think Lucy the Schnauzer might have a, a opportunity to possibly, her favorite thing is petting and we're trying to breed petting. And if she has a strong personality, there's a chance that being in the middle may be her natural aptitude. I can't really ask for better, to be completely honest. Steady, I believe, is the best for natural aptitude in the middle. So, ooh. but Winter Wind, I love you. But we can always re-adopt the dogs, that's the thing. Here you can see, look, there's Harmony. If Harmony ever wants to come back in, Rudolph and Harmony are the two dogs that we have since seen off uh, and they're immediately back here. The roster will constantly have dogs that we already had. So I think I'm gonna I'm gonna do the hard thing right now because I, I have a feeling that it's the smart thing to do. I love Winter Wind. She is beautiful. She is fantastic. And she may join us again in the future. She hasn't even been trained yet, so this is perfectly fine. Her favorite thing is perfectly timed catches. Uh, she does absolutely no rapport with anyone, no aptitude. So if we remove her right now and bring her, oh, I can't believe I did that, that's so hard. We can bring her back in in the future, okay guys? We can bring her back in in the future. And now look at our league expenses. They just dropped like a rock. And I think that one way or another, we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna let Yuki retire. I kind of really wanna hire one of these dogs is the thing. And Lucy might be what we're looking for. And her favorite thing is petting, so we could breed her with our boys. But actually, now that I'm thinking about it, we have more girls. We have a lot more girls. Well, Yoshi is a boy and he'd be cute to breed with our schnauzer. But I would want to breed like our two fame dogs. Uh, and actually, mm, mm, oh, I can't make up my mind. If we had, if we had a, 
And Maximus is a boy. Mm, should I adopt her? I'm grabbing a dice. My dice says no. My dice says we should not adopt a new dog at this point. And that's true. We have a new puppy that we could potentially train. So sorry for the distraction. I just really trying to figure out the right thing to do sometimes is very overwhelming when we have so much going on. All of our pups are pretty tired. So let's go ahead and everybody's just gonna have a good rest day. I don't think it's a bad thing to have Winter Wind adopted out right now because she literally has no traits, no skills. That might be a thing when we're tight on money that we do with the new puppies is just immediately put them out because then we can come back over and look, she's right there. And then for just $2,000, we could bring her back in when she hasn't even developed any skills or anything yet. So it'd be perfect. All right, I feel better about that now. Everybody, take a nap. <clears throat> All right, there we go. And actually, now that we have Max and now that we have Everpine back, I need to be sure to give them pets every day because that is their favorite thing. <gasps> and we have a race. It is a snowy night race. There's a lot of wind, occasional restocks, usable snow. Let's do it. We're gonna take every single race we can possibly handle and we're gonna do our absolute best at it. All right, and then Everpine is apparently really good in the middle. I really, or at the wheel, or at the um, lead, even though her specialty is at the wheel. <sighs> Let's see, Mary, Max, Maximus middle. Is Mary any good? Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and grab Mary to train her up some more, but we need this money. All right, there we go, guys. Mary, you're gonna need these treats pretty frequently. Curse you, tree. Sure, I'm gonna have like enough treats this time, but that's not the point. The point is that was rude. Whoops, ah, tree. All right, hang in there, Yuki, I'm coming. Oh, Mary, you got tangled. Oh, Yuki, why couldn't you eat that treat? Oh, Mary, eat this treat. All right, the races are gonna be full of drama, excitement, very hungry dogs. Yes, okay, good, good, good. Uh-oh, we've got a confused pup. Okay, good. Domino, grab that. Oh, Domino, you were supposed to grab that. It was going to give you supplies. Oh, Sierra and Striker are being really hard to feed. Trying to get used to having such a huge dog team is very tricky. Oh, go Yuki, go, I'm so proud of you. Oh wait, now that Max is back, I should have had Max out too. Because he is our, actually our best wheel dog. Um, no offense, Yuki. Yuki really does pull her weight. I just don't know if she wants to like continue. It's kind of like we talked about a couple weeks ago when Harmony left. Uh, it, this is like being on a sports team. And sometimes you're just ready to retire from the sport. Holy cow. I don't even know what all that flashing was about, but I'm glad my dogs are happy. All right, hang in there, Mary. Hey, Mary, you tangled up. Ah. Dang it, Mary lunged forward and actually tangled up some of our other dogs. <gasps> we made it! You guys, yes! I was so busy untangling my pups, I didn't even notice. Good job, puppers! Oh, thank goodness. All right, let's see. Did we get very much fame? There were a lot of flashing cameras, so even though it was night, Yuki's rapport with the other dogs is going up. Mary! Mary now has middle specialty at level two. Huzzah! I can hear the jing jing jingling of all of her wonderful, uh, like she wears the traditional Christmas reef collar, which I really love. Sierra might need a bit of a rest. I could really do with a few middle dogs to spell my current middle dogs. Gosh, yeah, I'm really gonna have to think about how we're gonna handle this. Basically, I want to have lots of puppies. <laughs> and I think you can actually dodge the league dues if I send my dogs out to breed. By the way, I'm beginning to notice that. So we'll have to see. We're holding on to League 7. And I want to see the new puppy. So let's go ahead and rest. And then we'll get our first chance to train the new puppy and see what she wants. And I'm kind of trying to just 
decide like it's 14 days away we might have a lot of money i think we might see what we can do with all of the money that we're about to start making that's a good question all right and then everybody is relaxed with the jerk but maximus actually needs some rest one two three four five six so i'm gonna let maximus get some rest there all right there we go yeah i'm not sure quite how many dogs we really need but I have a feeling we're over a little bit by either Yoshi or Everpine. Whew. But I really love Everpine, but she is kind of more for breeding, isn't she? We almost never really keep her for racing because she is not a natural at the middle and we unfortunately trained her in the wrong spot. Hmm. And Yuki wants to retire. I'm beginning to get some ideas. And uh, I do kind of want to just start breeding a chicken. I do kind of want to start getting the other species or species, the other breeds of dog. And I do want to try breeding some of the other dogs. And I do just want to see, I kind of want to just get to the point where we have our main team and some pups that we train. Because now that we are becoming a super famous, uh, super famous person and we are running a super famous group of dogs it makes sense that we would start kind of like training the best of the best dogs and breeding some of the best of the best dogs hmm that makes sense like we might train them up a little bit before swapping them out i'm gonna have to think about this all right i'll get three chances to spend time with snowstar and see what kind of attributes she'll grow into i can choose to condition her natural aptitude skill type fault type or favorite thing then i'll see what i then i'll see what will come of it all right, so let's go ahead and try to condition her favorite thing. She has super potential for petting. It's petting. Snowstar's favorite thing is going to be petting. And now we'll have to see what kind of dog she develops into. You know, I think I'm feeling pretty confident about that. I think I know which two dogs, now that Everpine has had a daughter who loves petting, uh, she and Yuki might actually consider retiring again because we can always bring them back in the future. They are right here. We can bring them back. It wouldn't be forever. And that would let us actually hire some of the other dog breeds or even just like pick a really handsome dog that we want to breed our dog with. Like that might be kind of consecutive catch, perfect catch, fame fog victory what if you know sierra and striker haven't had that many pups they might have a little bit of a connection with max and domino but maybe somebody really catches their eye and we might we might temporarily like send them off with aristotle the black lab and they could consider having a puppy with them the options could be endless so yeah, that basically that's all just to say, like, don't despair, guys, if we end up rotating our dogs a lot faster now, because we can always get them back, and it'd be fun to let them have their own puppies and see what comes of it. All right. Everybody gets pets. Everybody gets pets. Apparently, I have a new sponsorship deal coming up. Let's try to get at least one more race in today. Nice. The perfect timing. Snowy weather. So Domino would actually love that. Only a four dog team. I think this is a good one. All right. We're going to go ahead and have Max. It's been a long time since he has had his, well, he's had his favorite thing, petting. His race has been a while. Uh, and actually, it'd be really fun if Mary could possibly end up having a puppy one day. That would be kind of fun too. But no, we can't do that. We can't do that. Uh, she is our puppy, basically. And then who are we going to have in the lead? Let's have Yoshi in the lead because it's been a while since we have had him in the lead. And I'm going to go ahead and have Striker. Yeah, we'll have Yoshi be the one we train today. No, today is snowing and I was going to have Domino here. Oh, I forgot. I totally forgot. And then there we go. Sierra, Striker, you guys get a couple snacks to start us off. And then little Yoshi is going to want some snacks. Max never wants snacks. I need to remember that. I think he's like a light eater or something. And so he hardly ever needs treats. Uh, I don't think that, unfortunately, yay! All right, Yoshi was able to get that. All right, hang in there, little puppy. All right, Yoshi, can you grab this before we hit the rock? Great timing. Whoa, there's fame all over the place. Everybody loves this little dog. That's okay, Yoshi. I wasn't planning on racing you today because, you know, it's Domino's favorite day, a snowy day. But I have to admit, you're ridiculously cute and you are extremely popular with the cameras. 
Whenever Yoshi comes out, everybody's just like, oh, it's little Yoshi again. Go, little guy, go. He's so small. How does he do it? They just love him. All right. Whoops. All right. Come on, Yoshi. Come on. There we go. Oh, cute little bark. Cute little bark. Everybody loves him. Jeez, the camera cannot get enough of him. <laughs> look at him lead the way. He just makes it look so easy whenever we have him out here. For crying out loud, Striker, would you please accept a treat when I toss one to you? Yoshi! Oh, you missed it. <laughs> All right, more winnings. We are gonna be drowning in money and that will give me a good chance, even though I had to like mutter to myself endlessly. Oh, Max apparently didn't want to go with Yoshi today. I, I don't think he was happy with it. I think that Max may have been jealous because Max loves being famous. And uh, yeah, Yoshi definitely, ooh, Sierra got a good bit of fame. I think Yoshi got the most fame out of the day though. He's gonna need a good rest and his fame. Oh, actually he did not get the most fame. Max, why are you fussing? His, his, his rapport went down with Yoshi. Sierra and Stryker and Max actually got the most fame, but Yoshi was so cute being there. Seven races as the lead dog now. Does he have a, yeah, this lead specialty one. That is so good. All right, well, our puppers are doing great. I do wanna see more puppers. Uh, I do think Yuki is ready to retire. And uh, I do think that I wanna start rotating our pups a bit more so we can see more dogs. I know I've been muttering and muttering and muttering about that. It's just really hard to make decisions about those kinds of things. And we have a new puppy incoming. And actually, I kinda wanna breed Yoshi. Maybe, Yoshi, who do you have the biggest rapport with? Sierra? I, I actually think Yoshi and Sierra might make a really cute couple and we could send them out and see what happens. That may be what we have to do next time. So all right guys, if you could do please leave a like to toss a treat to our wonderful pups. And if you would like to cheer them on on the sidelines next time, do please consider subscribing for this and literally thousands more adventures. And I will see you guys then. Bye-bye.